What's up guys? It's Wednesday, so you know what that means. We're back again for another Waterfowl Wednesday. And today, we're going to be talking about things you need when you're hunting public land. Whether it be walk-in hunting or if you're even if you're going access by boat. These are some things you might want to consider having to call your gear to and from the boat or to and from the truck or car. So, here's what we got. We've got a I've got a beaver tail, a beaver tail large sled in it right now, in this bag, in this rig and right bag. I've got two dozen decoys, I've got my shotgun, I've got my blind bag, and I've got two Mojo Marsh seats. Only thing missing in here would be Cade's blind bag and we'd be on our way to the field. It's super easy to move, it's got a rope on the end of it, and you just walk and take this with you wherever you need to go. Nothing to it. And over here, if it's if we're hunting together, if it's me and him together like it usually is, I would be using the beaver tail sled. Or I'd be pulling one. He could be pulling the other. We got another. Got his gun in here. We got the sled, and he's got another dozen decoys. So that's three dozen decoys, two sleds, and. You know, this one also, this is the Jet Sled, Jet Sled brand. It's a little bit smaller, about the same weight, easy to drag. You can take that in with you as you're walking in, whether it be from the car, truck, or the boat. You can throw these in your boat. You know, if you're going to, you know, maybe some flooded timber or something, and you, you park your boat, you can throw these out. If you got to walk a little ways to get to the X, they'll float, put all your gear in there, and it'll, you can just pull it right there behind you. No need to have to try to tote everything and be weighted down. All right, on to the next thing you can get is a deer cart. Now you can pick up one of these deer carts online. I got this one from, from Rogers.com. They got them on sale right now for like $79.99. It's a deal. They're normally like 140 bucks. I put this thing together in about five minutes. No tools needed. Goes together pretty quick, very easy. It's got this black bottom in it that you can, that's removable. You can take that off and you just be exposed to the bare metal, bare framework. So this is something else you can use. And the best thing about it is it works in conjunction with the sled. So I'm gonna put this on here. I'm gonna put the sled on here and show you how you can use it if you're doing walk-in hunting for dry fields or or maybe to a flooded marsh or something like that. So I'm gonna put this together and we'll show you how this works out. All right, we got our beaver tail sled on the deer cart now. We got two dozen decoys in the bag, blind bag, gun, two marsh seats. And Kay's gonna be, Kay would be behind us pulling the other sled. And we got this, look here, this ain't nothing. Nothing to this. Simple. Nothing too pushing this thing. It ain't nothing no, no harder or easier than pushing a buggy at Walmart or your local supermarket. Got your sled on here. You can pull it behind you or you can push it in front of you. Whatever one you want to do. It ain't nothing to it. So if you don't, if you don't have one of these or either one of these, I highly recommend you getting a the Eagle Claw Jet Sled brand or maybe the Beaver Tail. Um, if I had to choose between the two, I'd say I, I kind of would lean more towards the beaver tail brand. I think it's a little bit, it's a little bit lighter um, and a little bit, the dimensions on it are a little bit larger than the jet sled brand. They're a little more pricey, a little more expensive than the jet sled, but it's a, it's a bigger sled for the money. And uh, in conjunction with the deer cart, it's going to be the way to go when we go to Nebraska this year doing some walk-in hunting. And we're going to take this stuff with us probably when we go to Arkansas too. Um, you know, definitely the sleds, you know, we throw everything in the boat, park the boat, and then we can pull our decoys and blind bags and everything else to our tree where we'll be out in the flood of timber this year. So looking forward to using this stuff. I hope this helps you out. Uh, if you don't have something like this, I encourage you to get it. It's, it'd be a, it's a, be a, a very vital tool to your, to your gear as far as hauling your stuff in and out to the blind. So. Till next week, guys, y'all bust them up.